Okay, this is uh, Attack of the Pickle Worm Part 2. Uh, we're going to go ahead and have the camera set up this time so I can get you some better pictures. And we also have some better stills and we'll be posting those also on the blog for you uh, when we uh, post this video. But let me show you first. These are from um, some butternut squash um, and uh, that that are over in our other garden which is actually a soil based garden but uh, you can see inside the flower here it looks like some type of uh, eggs or something that has been laid inside the flower and I want to show you here there's a hole where it's entered the flower and then you know of course as the fruit is growing you can see the hole where it pushes out its stuff or where it also can make entry into a if it didn't make entry through the flower into the squash itself and there we go there's a shot of one of the pickle worms. See them moving there? There you go. That's what they look like. Got a better picture of it this time for you. And they are pretty active once you stir them up there. But let me go ahead and I'll cut into this and we can see what's inside the flower. It's pretty much, you know, a mess in there. Okay. There's that. Now we can see if we cut into this one here. I'm going to do the same thing where near where the hole was and I can get back in there right. There you go. Yep. You can see there's where the eggs were all laid. Let me hold that up a little bit closer to the camera. So that's what it all looks like. See quite a few eggs there. And then let me cut into this piece of squash here. Let's see if we can see. There he is. Yep. Right there near the top. This is just a smaller one. Right there. And then again, we've got this one down here for you. You can see. I don't know what they look like. Let me bring it up closer to the camera. Hopefully you can see that. And again, uh, what we've sprayed today is we've gone ahead and we sprayed some neem oil um, on the plants. Um, we picked off all the affected um, fruit and flowers. Um, and the neem oil is done with the concentrate and it was uh, 30 milliliters or two tablespoons for one gallon. And we're putting that in a Hudson sprayer and spraying it. And we're going to see again um, how well we can, if we can get control over these. Ah, look at that. It looks like there was a little hole in the top going into the flower area. So that's probably where this one made entry. And then they'll put another hole in there, and that's where they push out all their excrement and uh, uh, dead material. And that's sometimes how you can see where they're at. You look around, it almost looks like little sawdust that's uh, laying around um, outside the hole where um, you know they have their access in and out of the, the fruit. So um, as we keep going again, if you have any suggestions, if you've encountered the pickle worm before, please uh, send your suggestions and comments to us. We definitely appreciate it and uh, take care. And again, happy gardening to you.